Okay, so it's me, Joy, and I'm riding around. And I just had this spiritual minded um, epiphany. And I was thinking, like, we've all been duped, we've all been wronged. Has mankind really sinned? I was thinking about the whole Garden of Eden thing. And it comes to my attention. How can you fault children who don't know anything? They don't like, they don't know any better. They're ignorant, really. How can we sin when we didn't even have the knowledge of sinning? Oh, I'm just saying, like, we were at a point of time in consciousness that we didn't know the tree of knowledge from good or evil. So the fact that he was tempted in the garden, the fact that, that we were left alone in the garden, that we were even told that there was a tree of knowledge not to touch, you know, gives you, um, you know, if you know human psychology, animal psychology, it's like you're, you're setting it up for temptation to be had, you know, it's all just this big trick or whatever. And it just feels like it's like innocence was manipulated and tricked into doing something wrong and then blamed for it. And then now we have this feeling of guilt and shame for the whole species. And I feel that is done because our gods are reptilian, they're evil, and they suck our energy. They're vampires. They eat, they eat, they feast off our energy. So that type of energy of lowbrow shame and guilt has been keeping them fed for millennia. Think about it. Message learned. I'm woken up. Woo!